Welcome to Overmonds. We are going to talk about the Overmonds stock search engine and how we invest in actual stocks. Today is May 20th. I will discuss how to pick stocks from the May 22nd top 10 stock list. What you see here in front of us is the SMI and the WIG40 from Poland, two stock indices where we will publish top 10 stocks on May 22nd. I'm Swiss, so I'll probably want to buy in Switzerland. Um, what we have here is the top 10 list for the stocks in Switzerland. Uh, it all starts with uh, the top 10 value strategy, the top 10 value stocks. It then shows the top 10 growth stocks, the top 10 safety stocks, and the top 10 Combined stocks. Combined is a combination of value stocks and safety stocks with a little bit of growth characteristics as well. Let's look what we have here in terms of top stocks we could pick from. Well, we have a couple of finance and trading oriented companies, Swiss Re, Transocean, Credit Suisse, that are more difficult to assess and I feel less comfortable for a long term investment. Then we have uh, three, four companies that are in, in, in true business, in businesses that are uh, uh, very uh, transparent and we, we know about it. There's Nestle, Syngenta, uh, which is in crops and fertilizers. There's Chilvondon, which does flavor, flavors and fragrances for the food and cosmetics industry. There's Holzing in construction materials, mostly cement worldwide. Then there's another finance company, ABB, the big techno technology component, and Adepro, an HR service company. I feel comfortable about investing in Nestle, Sinchenta, Chivona, Hudson, and ABB because these are companies that are produce something that people uh, actually need and have uh, a very good, uh, and I personally have a good way of assessing them. Let's look at the growth investment strategy. Here we have Rishma, it's growing strongly, and Luxury from the uh, Gibberit, which does uh, uh, a lot of hope, appliances, appliances. Octavian high technology. Well, growth is not something that uh, I use as a, as a big indicator because uh, we never know if the growth can continue or not. Safety for me is important as well. Again, the work is in Shiva, not very safe, um, as well as Nestle, very safe in finance, lots of cash in the bank account. Let's go to the combined strategy, which I think is the one um, we should look at. Uh, here uh, it's led by Shivondo, Nestle, Novartis. Um, these are all companies I like. Um, Shivondo seems to look the best right now, uh, but you know, I also uh, sometimes have some emotional feelings attached to it. I really like Nestle, the global reach. Let's look how they look in detail. Um, what I find important here is this section achievements. Uh, it gives me information if there are additional things to consider uh, about these companies. And I uh, really like that this is a good governance stock, family friendly. It has some incentive systems for management and uh, it even is careful with the climate. Very positive. Let's see how it looked in the past. It was always uh, ranked highly, you know, it's actually now ranked better than it used to be. Um, it uh, had more growth in the past, maybe that's a reason why it's not that uh, expensive anymore, why the value of the company went up. Let's look at the value metrics in detail. Uh, in respect to size, revenues, and capital, it's actually, uh, Nestle actually um, is, is not that good, which means that they're mainly uh, generating a lot of cash right now. Well, we don't know what the future will bring. Um, maybe there's a small indication here. Growth has been a problem recently. Um, but, you know, this could be turned around. You know, Nestle management is, is a good management, like in many, many companies. So, you know, the future may well turn out better than it can also in terms of growth. What is important to me also as a long term investment investor uh, is the, the leverage and liquidity rank. That's why I think. Today. This is my first stock I'm buying uh, out of the top 10 lists and Nestle is a company I feel very comfortable about because I also see it everywhere I go in the world. Uh, the 
same is true of course. Maybe we are both say the next day is not different after all. It's funny about it. And I did buy it. I want to show that to you too. Uh, this is my trading account. Uh, what you see here is uh, the reminder of 50,000 francs, which is my plan to invest over the next six months. So this is my plan. This is not necessarily your plan. Uh, you have to decide how much you want to invest based on your financial situation. Best to do that with a financial consultant that helps you plan your finances. I decided I want to invest 50,000 in stocks over the next six months based on my financial plan. I do it slowly, you know, the, uh, talk, uh, the principle is slowly in and slowly out. That's what safe investing is all about. And I do it in installments of 10 stock purchases of around 5,000 francs. And you can see here, um, I actually have the stock. Let's say, um, let's look at the portfolio here. And it's the business thing. It's the business thing. So I bought uh, today at 73.85. Yes, that's my first purchase based on probably one to top 10 stocks. I hope you enjoyed it and you feel it inspiring for your next purchases. Thank you. Bye bye.